not a character we see too often, for sure. No. Not a matchup we'll see too often with Lucario. Yeah. And not Lucas. many Lucario players out here. The King of Wizards. Uh, Lucas fairly strong. Yeah, Lucas definitely one of those characters that I think their biggest strength might be in their ability to take early stocks with how much their like edge guard options are. Yeah. But the thing is, Lucario does have a really good recovery, so it's not going to be super easy to edge card him like it might be for other characters for Lucas. Yeah. So we'll see if Vivi knows how to play around. Yeah. Uh, also, King could be like Vivi might be unfamiliar with the Lucas pressure. Not many people do play Lucas, and his, he does have really strong pressure and strings just to do on the shield that people just don't recognize. Yeah, and if Lucario loses a stock early, that's like much more detrimental than your average character losing a stock early. And Lucas does have some unique gimmicks that he might not be ready for. But Vivi also, I think, very smart in how they play Lucario because they just, they will respect you to a, a fault even. Like, yeah. look how much he's just jumping back from that Zerk. He knows that's safe. So Vivi, what makes his Lucario so strong is he will not, he does not give people that many opportunities. He respects your options really smartly. Yeah. So we'll see. This knows, all right. And you can see the heal right there. Oh yeah, that is another factor. A heal and reflector on Lucas is going to make Aurasphere a lot less of a threat than it normally is. Oh, yeah. Vivi does like to look out for those S smashes. Oh, bear. And was down 80% and 10 seconds later is now up a stock. That's just the strength Lucario showing right there. Yeah. This ridiculous character that's able to hit hard. Down tilt. Gonna take it. Yeah, that was interesting. Yeah. I did yeah. not realize up tilt had that much kill power. I wonder if that was some bad DI yeah. from Vivi. They might have been holding away. Might have been. He went down and touched his toes and is yeah. like, yo, you're gone. <laughs> <laughs> All right. B reverse. Just trying to get a landing right here with Lucario. And the F tilt into jabs. Really strong. Really strong. Ooh. And just fares of his own. Just kicked him like four times in the chin. Yeah. Lucario, you don't see too much at low percents, but yeah. they do have some unique strings that they can only get with the low amount of knockback that uh, having no aura grants you. Yeah. So Vivi, obviously being such an aficionado of this character, is going to be able to get those. All right, rolling pass have now done a roll once, but Vivi still has somewhat right putting him back in the corner, and you can't roll into Lucario like that. Yeah, Vivi loves those F smashes because he, he knows that it's going to put so much fear into whoever he's fighting that even if it wasn't safe, people might be just too scared to punish that. It, it's just yeah. it, you emotionally are frozen when Lucario does a run back F smash in a tense scenario. Yeah, I'm definitely emotionally frozen. Ooh. All right, another kick in the face. Yeah, and I think that fair could come in really handy in this matchup because um, it has good, it has a good range and it can kill really early. It's like a aerial like Lucina F smash almost. It's it's pretty strong. So. Yeah. So. <laughs> An aerial Lucina F smash. Yeah. That's so crazy of a concept. <laughs> yeah, that's what um when my friend played Lucario, that's what he described it as, and it stuck with me. But or not Lucario, Lucas. Yeah. So, but regardless, BB could very easily run away with this lead right now with the aura he has on. Yeah. Okay. Is this? No. no. <laughs> not, it's not Ness. <laughs> yeah. Ooh, and yeah, weaving around that, this is, um, might be a rough matchup just because of how well Lucario can recover. And that's just, like, Luca, um, Lucas cannot get the normal edge guards. Yeah. So, I kind of want to see more grabs from King of Wizards. I was thinking the same thing, my friend. Yeah. <laughs> this PK fire is going to take it right there. But um, King of Wizards has not threatened with grab once. I know Lucas does not have a strong grab or grab game itself, but at least threatening with it. Oh, right there. At least, like, threatening the possibility that you're going to do it just allows Vivi not to sit in shield and allows you to just pressure him. Yeah, and in addition to that, he has, like, three kill throws, basically. F throw, up throw, and back throw, all kill. So yeah. when you're gaining Mikario to 170, the fact that he didn't go for a single grab there and didn't mix it up, definitely I do not agree with because you can up throw Lucario pretty much anywhere once yeah. you get to that percent. Yeah, and lucky enough for him, he managed to absorb the thing, and he was just able to live back. Lift those like that, those things, those combos are like hits from Lucario. Now being at 119. 
Yeah, and the beauty of losing to Lucario is um, he doesn't have that much ore on him, so you're not in as much danger as it may look, but though, at something as high as 139, pretty much anything will kill. Yeah. 151. But Lucas, strong character. All right. Just dropping the combo right there. That's not what you want to see if you're the king of wizards. Ooh, but this F tilt now 83%. Lucas can take this stock. Yeah. Terrain might end. Oh. Does um does VV become the new king of wizards if he beats King of Wizards? He might be. <laughs> That's a big deal. This this is a lot on the line for VV right here. Yeah. This is a career, you're like probably a lineage set for yeah. life. This a, is a renaissance. Yeah, thing. VV's really putting their soul into this set. Probably the most important set of their Smash career. I, I think so. Yeah. And King of Wizards, a lot to lose too. You know, yeah. he told his family that they would be okay in his castle. And now they're just gonna have to get and kicked out. Yeah. Might be beheaded. Yeah, that's how it goes in those yeah. times. You know, he's <laughs> played for his life, quite literally. I'm fighting for my life, man. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Support and counter pick right here. So what do you think we will go with this stage? Um, I think it's hard because normally Lucas does like space, but I feel like Vivi was able to play the, the defensive game better. They, they were able yeah. to... So, it, I feel like it might be a personal preference for King of Wizards, but we're going small battlefield. I think they saw how well Vivi was able to control space, and they were like, I don't want to give Lucario that much time to charge Aura, that much time, or that much time to charge Aura Sphere. Yeah. That much time to get set up. I want to pressure them to where they're not able to get anything going on. Okay. Yeah, I totally agree with the statement right there. And we got a color change. Oh, yeah. yeah. Wait. Yes. And Vivi. This. Yeah, this is this is what Vivi goes to and he wants to take over a monarchy. <laughs> Green color. Just vomit. <laughs> vomit Lucario. Yeah. This reminds me of Vomit's heart back in Smash 4. Yeah, I, I, I love like the I, mean, I didn't play it, but I thought it was funny. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I miss it. Uh, do we, I wonder if we still have that emote. If you want to find out, you can sub at House of 3000. Yeah, <laughs> it's the only way to find out. So you just yeah. you gotta you gotta sub right now. If not, spam the Vamos Hardy mode. <laughs> and King of, King of Wizards here, showing me are not ready to lose the castle. Really good lead right here, but we actually saw that last game. BB yeah. was at 100, but this time BB is dead. So yeah. just now able to close out the stock. Just more prepared of the situation. Seems like, but BB. Playing Lucario, and you can't keep a good Lucario down. Yeah, this this is Vivi's every daily life, losing yeah. a stock early and bringing it back. This is nothing to phase yeah. them. So he, he's like Rocky. Yeah, and, so, and if Rocky had a up. mechanic that um... <laughs> no Rocky. <laughs> yeah, yeah. If I you guess... watch the Rocky movies, he literally yeah. gets like ten like haymakers in the face, and he's like, yo, three good hits. Yeah, so Rocky's <laughs> real life Lucario, basically. Basically, Lucario's based off of Rocky. Yeah. <laughs> um, Game Freak said that. More you know. <laughs> he is fighting and steel type. <laughs> pretty, pretty rocky esque. Yeah. Oh. But you saw how quick he was just able to bring back that stock. And you see both of them now at two stocks apiece. Ooh. Clean. Bear. Oh. Yeah, F smash, down smash, not gonna take it right there. And what? And these guys are just like so wary of their these, each other's smash attacks right now. They're both trying to scout for the kill. King of Wizards, not gonna take it right there. This is... No, Ooh. not great matchup right there. I don't think that would have been the stock just yet. Wow. Oh, just living. Surprisingly yeah. weak up air from yeah. Lucas. I thought that might take it. Yeah, but, but PK Fire is actually going to take it. Yeah, PK Fire is straight in between the eyes, man. Yeah, and that was like roll distance on stage too. So Lucas kill power really just, it becomes in so many of their moves once you get to that percent. That yeah. There's just almost nothing Lucas will hit you with that doesn't kill you. Yeah, and they're really good at 
Just racking up damage. All right, now able to catch the jump right there, but this block dodge definitely will be caught in one stock apiece. Yeah, despite like um, losing their stock when King of Wizards was at a really lo low percent at the start, Vivi just shows why Vivi's Vivi. Um, gets this comeback with Lucario, and now uh, has a lot of momentum on their side and a quick percent lead. Yeah, potentially one of the best Lucarios in the state right now, or in the war U.S. Yeah, well, that, I'd, I'd say a firm U.S. Yeah. But, you know, I, we all have some tri-state bias. I think yeah. they're the uh, best, we're, we're one of the less. best in the world is VB. But okay, we we saw a counter almost come out. VB tried to play a little bit tricky right there. Oh, and just threatening with the aura sphere. Now just taking it to the dome oh, back air. I'm almost surprised I didn't kill. Uh, maybe with slightly bad DI. Oh. Yeah. <gasps> Ooh, it's still good, still good, still, still good. Still good. This character is ridiculous with the recovery. Yeah, but that was scary. Vivi was looking for uh, that command grab after Dare 1 right there. Yeah. Okay. Lucky. <laughs> yeah, and this is so scary for King of Wizards. They're going to need to get a read to break through this pressure. Yeah. Yeah, oh man, it's a roll. I mean, that just covered oh. so many options right there. Yeah, it's like you don't want to jump because it could just be red. Yeah. And VV just like, okay, you like probably got a buffer roll back and is like, yeah, you're just done for that. I mean, yeah, at rolls, I think I would maybe cover like roll spot dodge and roll in. Yeah. I couldn't, I'm not sure how good Lucas's roll in is, but, and well, jump's the last thing on your mind with that giant sphere above you. So yeah. that's just such crazy pressure. Um, um, he did die to back air before, and up. Uh, you could die to up air also to Lucario around yeah, that Yeah, especially percent. with that much aura. Yeah. It was, it was a wrap.